six and up to fifth, seven, eight. Now, we're gonna do développe front, passe. The main thing is we keep these bones nice. That See that bone that's right there, there you go. And then you're gonna come out front to the développe front. You're gonna resist that hip, e, there we go. And then you're gonna slice it down on line and lengthen the leg. That's it, and then we'll go down, push the floor away and come back to fifth. And we'll go side again. Don't be lifting that, that bone, ah, there. So you want that opposition in those bones and go one to the side, développe, and two, to, can you get a bit more length out of that leg? And if it doesn't go that far back, we can just tip it, there we go, and slice it back. So nearly past the shoe at the back, oh, nice, but give some opposition, that's it. There we go. Now we're just going to slide it out to the back, reach to the back. That's it. And then we're going to keep that toe nipping and tucking. Good. And then we're going to slide that through, open the arm, open the arm through first, and then bring it up through first. There we go. Brush and turn to the side. So we're going to keep it side and turn it, will turn itself into arabesque. There we go. And down. Great, great, good, darling. Let's do, um, let's do releve. One and two, passe, and four, small thing, a little turn. So we're going and dev to the front, passe to the back, and one and two, and turn. Very good. Okay, let's try that. And uh, one and two, one and two, one, resist the hip, resist it, and one, yep. Just, I just feel at the end of the turn that that's a little like that. So you really want, you want this, if it, ah, there you go. If this, yeah, yeah is higher even. So in a way, the knee doesn't feel like it's too pulled. Yep. Oh, nice. And keep those legs coming front, front, and go close fifth. And so far, put the foot back to go to turn to the other side. Uh huh. Good. And uh, fifth and down. Arms feeling front. Arms front. And good girl, that's good. Seven, good, that's different. Yeah, so you want a lot of yeah, tension out of the, let's go, let's go up, up, down, up, up, down, up, two, three, and down, two, three, and up, up, fifth. Let's go on top and up, up, and top, and one, two, three, and down. So part of bourree, mainly, again, that placement of every time your hips, none is here or there, it's placed right on top, like you're aiming for on line, for a line all through your body. And uh, up, 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 and uh, up, 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 and one, Heels forward, yeah, oh, nice. Eight, good girl. And uh, up, up, yes, up, and up, up, up. Now twist the legs around those hip joints. Yes, nine, good. Go into fifth, on point. Uh, other leg behind, yeah. So when we go to arabesque, we're gonna to go to first. Now we're gonna think about the leg going underneath the floor. So this leg is going underneath the floor and see that dint? We want that dint as much, right starting from the beginning. So go back to the again now. Now, this leg is long and is pushing down and this leg, that toe is going under the floor to get out under, 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 that's beautiful. There's just a moment there where that joint takes over, the outside joint, and it's got to be the inside joint. Yeah. Inside joint, that's very good. Inside, very good. There you go. 
That's it, love. Gives you more power and strength. Do the other leg, other side. See, because you can see it. Yeah, don't. So inside the joint, that's it. That one, this one's a tiny bit, for me, a tiny bit wide. Like, so it's just got to be, maybe it's not as easy as the other leg. But yeah, under the floor, your hip joint, hip joint. Yeah, nice, nice. Good, darling. Very good. Yeah. You can feel that in both hip joints. So if you're standing here and go up to first, those hip joints inside are trying to get as close to each other without straining. So you've got light legs, you've got strong feet, and the hip joints are trying to get as close, you know, those, those ones at the back of the joint, as close to each other, and it should switch on the inside of your legs. So at no point do you let go of that. That Can you feel that? So it's just that, that the use of all of those exercises without going crunch, you're rotating those and if they keep, and then when you go to fifth, you keep them close to each other. Yeah, then you go passe, so it's light leg. Yeah, you go, there you go, you can feel that. And if you do pirouette as well, you don't want them away from each other, you want them close to each other. Yes, very nice. And it comes through, doesn't come through, comes through lightness in the legs, but work in those joints, yeah.